High school football season kicks off tomorrow night in Alabama. There will be some new rules in place for fans at the stadium. Our Quentin Smith went to a school district in Alabama today. He joins us in the studio with the details on that. Quentin. Yeah, Andrea, here in Mississippi, high school students involved in the football game can only bring two people to that game. Well, over in Alabama, things are a little different. The Lamar County School District says it's not putting a limit on the number of people allowed in the stands. They're just requiring them to social distance themselves and to wear a face covering. Empty fields and bleachers. These are the sites at football fields in Lamar County, Alabama. But that's all about to change. The Lamar County Bulldogs are set to face the South Lamar Stallions in a county rivalry Friday night. I know people are ready to see us get back into action. Spectators will be able to watch the big game, but there will also be a few requirements. Everyone is required to wear a face mask or face covering at all times while they're within six feet of someone. Only those within the same household can sit and congregate together. Everyone else must social distance themselves. Parents must also supervise their kids at all times, and only essential people are allowed to be on the field. Within uh, our county, our stadiums, uh, with our attendance over the last several years, uh, uh, will be able to handle the social distancing. Uh, we just got to bank on people doing their job. Superintendent Vance Heron spent more than a decade coaching in this big game. While he's confident with his plan, he understands some fans may not agree with the rules in place. If this is real important to them, whether you believe in the mask or whether you don't believe in the mask, if this is real important to them to, for us to try to keep our kids safe and everybody safe, then just follow the guidelines and that's put that mask on. Karen says the district is doing its part to keep everyone safe while still having fun during the ball games this year. Everybody's not going to enjoy having to not be able to get up and go speak to everybody else and you know, but we can still have a good time and we can still uh, cheer on our team and, and uh, do all that in a safe manner uh, during this time of, uh, of unknown. Because after all, One, two, three, zero. Heron says it's all about the kids. And just a reminder, anyone who does not abide by these rules may be asked to leave the game.